All right, this is an Opentron's demonstration of doing medicinal genomics UPCR uh, setups. These are genetic tests for cannabis that can help detect powdery mildew, russet mites, look for CBD and THC and uh, CBG genetics, but also look for male-female detection. So today we're going to do male-female. The DNA is in the green plate. The reagents um, that have been all pre-mixed are in those wells, and they're going to get distributed to these eight wells on this little platform. It's only 4K. Real simple, good user interface here for, for uh, joysticking this uh, this machine around without, without any uh, any complications. And it's all run on Python. A little, uh, little crude on the Python. There's not a lot of uh, you know, GUI that you can use to input how much you want to do, but these two um, variables right here are their starting row in the plate and how many rows you want to do. Uh, and that gets uploaded to this interface to run. And a very simple interface here allows these things to take off and there we go homing a robot and this process will run about two minutes and 45 seconds these 16 samples that's about 330 samples per hour and uh, plenty fast enough for uh, a lot of folks needs for screening seedlings or clones so again the, the reason to want to detect powdery mildew um, in cannabis is that before it actually becomes infectious, it builds this vascularized network in the plant that we can pick up with DNA. So you can actually catch the plants and cull them before this stuff spreads. Same idea with russet mite eggs. Um, but the, the earliest stage possible, if you can pick them up, you can avoid them. Um, there's also some uh, <clears throat> benefit for doing this with male females, obviously, if you want, if you're dropping seeds and you want to get the males out, you can look for the Y chromosome and uh, that will uh, tell you whether you got male or female. So now it's just going to punch on these P10s. These P10s allow us to pipette smaller volumes, so there's going to be a 2 microliter aspiration from this plate that has um, samples that have been boiled. And it looks like we got a good pipe. Everything's even there. There we go. And that's all she wrote. All right, and that just repeats for the next row. So again, 4K, pretty simple, it's lightweight. You can pick it up with one person and easily move it around. It runs off of a simple USB cable and uh, some uh, pretty simple Python scripting tools. All right, this is the last one. And